Welcome back guys, it's me Lizzie, and today is day three of my Edible Perennial series. If you've missed the last two, don't forget to check them out after this video is over. And if you need another reason to grow edible perennials in your yard, here is a good one. Because perennials remain in the soil for multiple years, the root system help improve the soil structure. As they grow and spread their roots, the soil is aerated and channels are created for the water to travel through the soil. This helps both the perennial plants and other plants in that area get the oxygen and water they need. One edible perennial that my daughter loves and I always feel safe having her harvest on her own is mint. Mint has a USDA hardiness zone of three through 11. And as long as it has well-drained roots, Mint is a perennial that can stay outside through the winter. And in warm zones, it'll grow all year. In the colder zones, it'll actually die back to its roots before re-emerging in the spring. Because of mint's very fragrant tooth leaves and tiny purple, pink, or white flowers, mint is easy to identify and easy to harvest. My daughter loves making us fresh mint water on those hot days in the summer when we're working on the homestead. But we also love using it when we roast pork. Dice up mint and scallion with some olive oil and use it as a rub over your pork. All right guys, make sure you subscribe and stick around for tomorrow's edible perennial because this one I'm sure you may have never heard of before. Thanks for watching Little House and Homestead.